The absence of such growth in climate catastrophes across Russia over the span of 10 years is an apparent paradox. This paradox is explained by the fact that the experimental equipment developed by a non-public group of Alatra scientists exerted a real and tangible influence in reducing both the rate and severity of climate-related disasters in this region. Naturally, this equipment is not a panacea. It did not eliminate the underlying causes of a climatic or geodynamic changes. However, its operation did significantly reduce the intensity and frequency of catastrophic events, effectively dampening dangerous fluctuations in much the same way that dampening systems function in engineering structures. Like a dam holding back water, the equipment contained the growing pressure, preventing it from tipping into a destructive scenario. However, in August 2023, Due to the designation of the Alatra movement as an undesirable organization within the Russian Federation, the operation of this equipment was forcibly halted. It was dismantled and removed from Russian territory. Shortly thereafter, one of the Alatra scientists publicly stated that the main conclusions regarding the catastrophic trends in the countries formally within the operational range of the experimental equipment would become apparent within three to four months. Meanwhile, the full trajectory of disaster dynamics would manifest within six to nine months once the mitigating effects of the equipment's operation had dissipated entirely. As a result, a record surge in both the number and severity of climate-related disasters was duly recorded across Russia and parts of Eastern Europe from August 10th through November 2023. This trend has only intensified with each passing month. Following the equipment's deactivation, climate-related disasters in Russia began occurring in a cascading pattern, striking one after another in rapid succession, with each subsequent event surpassing the last in magnitude.